button push. Nick no. Carter, I think we're live. I know, right? I never know when we're live. <laughs> hey guys, it's Candace here in the studio with Nick Carter. Obby. People know who you are. From the Backstreet Boys, from ABC's boy band. We have some questions from Twitter, so we're going to just answer a few of those real quick. Okay. Um, this person is just going with it. When will there be a new Backstreet album? That's what uh, they're going That's up. actually right. Uh, we're in the studio right now, recording. So uh, I, I'd say really soon. Okay. Uh, you know, getting new music in and... Um, while I'm actually filming the boy band TV show, I'm going to be jumping into the studio in and out. Okay. So we should have a single ready to go within, like, I'd say the next month or so. Okay, we're going to hold you to that, Nick. You should. We are. All right, next <laughs> question says, uh, are you thinking of having the boy band who wins boy band on ABC go on tour with the Backstreet Boys next year? I actually thought that that would be a really cool thing to do, uh, bring the guys out on the road. Um, it just kind of makes sense. We're getting ready. Once we release our, our single and, and, and our, our album and we start doing our promotion stuff, next year, I'd say maybe around like April, we'll start going on tour, like the world tour. And then we'll hit like all over the world from you know Japan to, to Europe to, to America to Canada. That, that's the one thing that's great about the Backstreet Boys is that we can actually go everywhere. And, and so I think the, the boy band opening up for us would just make sense. Okay, that's a big prize, whoever wins. Yeah. Um, all right, who's your favorite artist right now? Oh, goodness. Uh, God, I'm trying to see. I'm, I'm really into a lot of hip-hop right now uh, okay. and, like, R&B. Um, I guess, I think his name's uh, Khalid. Khalid, yeah. I really love that song out right now. That's okay. a dope song. That's a good answer. Um, what is your favorite BSB music video of all time? Uh, my favorite BSB music video of all time would be probably Backstreet's Back because okay. it is, it's just so interesting. People and, are shaking their heads and, in the room. We all agree, yeah. yes. Well, it's just because, <laughs> you know, in our mind, we were doing, like, paying homage to, to Thriller in, in our own way, uh, yeah. you know, with this monster sort of dance break and all these things um, through it, which be later became iconic with our dance moves. Um, so, but uh, little facts about it is that it was one of, back then, uh, we were paying a lot of money for those music videos. That thing, that thing okay. cost almost. I think it was like one point three million dollars to make that wow. music video, and and uh, nobody spends that money anymore. <laughs> but it was because we had to actually build sets. Like they, right. we, there was full sets being built for it. Okay, that's a good fun fact. Um, if you could go back in time, what showbiz advice would you give your younger self? Hashtag BSB. Hashtag boy band. Hashtag Vegas. <laughs> they said. Hashtag hashtag hashtag. Yeah. Um, yeah, um, I, I think just it's the same thing I've been doing. It just have fun, you know. Like I, I think when you're having fun, like people just notice it and they and, and they gravitate towards it. And it's yeah. it's attractive, you know. Like so, uh, just keep having fun. There was there was a time when it didn't become as much fun because the business kind of got involved. So I just maybe I'd go back and say, hey Nick, you know, just you know when all these these negative things start coming across, you know, just just make sure you just keep stay stay yourself, stay stay who you are, stay youthful, stay fun. That's good advice. Um, what's it like seeing yourself in these young men on boy band? That's from Hannah. Hi, Hannah. Uh, seeing myself? Yeah, just kind of back at the beginning and trying. I, well, to... you know, I think when I look at them, there's like last week I, I mentioned this about Braid Sutton. I said, listen, I just, again, that's that bit of advice I basically yeah. gave him. You know, don't let that business kind of, you know, take, take a hold of you and, and change you. Um, and then when I see all of these boys, you know, they... They're so young, and they have so so much to learn and, and so much so much room to grow. Yeah. And and I and I think it's just it kind of gives flashbacks a little bit of you know you know when I was really really young, I was all of pretty much all of their age, at some like in, in 15, 16, 17 when we really broke hard. So there's a lot of parallels. All right, two more questions. This is from Crazy for BSB. She <laughs> says after at boy band ABC is done. Will you still be helping the boys producing, or is your job done after the show is done? Well, we're gonna. I'm gonna be there for the guys no matter what. If they want to, are they gonna be able to get your number? And if they want. We talked about it. If they go on tour with us and stuff, and they want advice, um, you know, of course they're gonna get my number. And and you know, the thing about this show is that you gotta understand, like, it's ten weeks of of this grueling competition, and you you there, you have no choice but to, to kind of. Uh, you know, know each other. We're around each other all the time, and right. and and so I think that uh, you you create a bond, you know, with them. And there's 
that, that, that it just can't be broken. I, I experienced the same thing when I did Dance with the Stars. You know, like all all of the cast, all of the dancers, and everybody, we have a bond. Um, that, that just can never be broken. I think that's going to happen with this. Yeah, I think so too. Thursdays on ABC. Nick Carter is here. This has been so much fun. Anything you want to say to the fans watching before we go? L O V hashtag L O V E. Love you guys. <laughs> <laughs> no, and seriously, thank you so much for all your support throughout the years. Um, we say this so many times, but without you guys, there would be no, none of us. You know, the, the kind of fans that you are are beyond supportive, uh, beyond resilient. You are. You are just the best fans in the world, and because there's times when being a Backstreet Boys fan, you know, basically people could maybe like make fun of you or maybe say some things or whatever throughout the years. But now, because you you stayed strong and because you didn't care, didn't listen to the haters and all that stuff, you basically now are are part of something extremely special, and you're part of the Backstreet Army. Yes. Can we just go out with the everybody move? Is da, that we still da, 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 Ow. <laughs>